Ooh, foggy morning. Sun's coming up. It's about 6.30 a.m. Hey, what are you getting ready to do? I'm going to Disneyland. What? Want to come with me? <laughs> Why would you do that? Because it sounds like a great thing to do. And what else are we going to do? You look cute. Thank you. I got my Christmas shirt on. All right. Let's go. Let's get on the road. Bill Lisa. Hi everybody, I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Bill. Together we are Bill Lisa. Welcome to our channel and welcome to season two. We are blasting off to infinity and beyond. And we don't want you to miss a minute of the fun, so make sure you click that subscribe button down below. We have made it to Disneyland and we are right next to the biggest Christmas tree in the park. But there are so many other Christmas trees around that sometimes you may walk right by. So we're gonna take a trip around the merriest place on earth and show them to you. Let's go. What'd you think? That was great. Awesome. Have a wonderful day, ladies. You too. Thank you. This beautiful tree is nestled back behind the guided tours stand. Most people walk right by as they come in and they don't even look over here if they're not coming in for a tour. But this tree is so beautiful with all of the multicolored Christmas ornaments. I love coming back here. It's a nice place where you can just sit and relax and enjoy the Christmas lights and get a little holiday spirit. Inside the market house is another tree. It is really cute. It has oranges and pine cones and it's themed to the restaurant that's in here. This is primarily Starbucks and food and things like that. And so they've done a nice job of decorating it with food items. But I really, really love this tree because most people don't even know it exists unless you actually come inside and look around. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Good to see you guys. Happy New Year. Merry Thank Christmas. You. Inside the china closet, you're gonna find two trees. This one has Mickey Mouse shaped bulbs. All of the ornaments in here on the trees are for sale. So if you find something you like, you can just take it up to the register and purchase it. Let's head across the store to the other tree. Come on, it's all princess themed ornaments. You can find your favorite princess like Brave or Frozen Elsa or bell anything you're looking for they're gonna have in here so come on in take a look at the tree and while you're enjoying it pick out an ornament for yourself we've made it inside the plaza inn restaurant where they have two trees one in the end of each dining room these trees are so beautiful and elegant they fit the theme inside here just perfectly they have these really cute bird cages, flowers, and bows. It's really, really nice to look at while you're sitting in here and dining. But most people wouldn't even know they existed if they didn't come inside. So that's why you need to really look around when you're here at the parks during the holidays. giant Christmas tree. This scene actually contains 150 candles on the tree and around the tree. This was once a European tradition to put actual candles in a tree and light them, which now today people now use strung lights around the Christmas tree for the same representation. Even Toontown has Christmas trees. Let's head inside and check them out. Christmas tree is right here in the eating area. So there's a lot of seating for people to sit, have their meal, and look at a beautiful Christmas tree. Come on, let's go find more. 
We've made it to Minnie's house and I would expect nothing different than a tree with pink ornaments. It is so cute and so fancy. Just Minnie's style. Mickey's house is a more traditional tree with the more traditional colors and some beautiful sparkly stars. Hello, my dear. How are you? I'm beautiful. Let me get you in better light. Oh, yeah. There we go. The best light. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> choose an ornament for yourself. This is one of the trees back in the corner of the holiday shop, but there's also another one right down here. Why did you like one? Which one? Small tree? I don't like it. Big tree. Okay, and it's blue. Alright, let's head to the next location. As you head into Adventureland, Right when you start approaching the Jungle Cruise, make sure you look up because there is a tree there. And wow, that is bananas. Yes, they have bananas as garland. So you probably don't want to bring any monkeys here around the holidays because they'll probably find it quite appealing. All right, that's enough of that. Let's split. tree in the list is all the way back here in Critter Country and it is the Winnie the Pooh tree back here in Pooh Corner. It is so cute and perfectly themed, decorated with carrots of course for rabbit. I love this tree. This is actually one of my favorite trees in Disneyland. is suspended high above Splash Mountain. It is actually a tree that has a note on it from Br'er Rabbit to Br'er Bear and Br'er Fox. And this just shows you that even Br'er Rabbit can set aside his differences this time of year. I'm good, how are you? Good, I didn't recognize you in the car. I know, right? It's Coca-Cola Refreshment Center and this is definitely a themed tree. We have Santa with Coca-Cola bottles and we also have the little polar bear with a Coca-Cola scarf. There's also a really cute Coca-Cola train. I love this tree. It just makes me smile. So make sure if you stop by the Coca-Cola Refreshment Center to get an ice cold Coca-Cola to drink, you check out the tree in here. Up in the window of Walt's apartment, right above the fire station, sits a cute, quaint little Christmas tree. There's usually a light in the window that Walt Disney would leave on when he was here to show people that he was here in the park. But at Christmas time, he exchanged it with a tree. So now during the holiday season, the cast members put the tree up and they turn the lights on so that at night everyone can see the glowing Christmas tree. Take your time. <laughs> okay, just smile and I'll take a few.
have a great day. All right, everybody, we're gonna end our video here. We've made it back to the tallest Christmas tree inside of Disneyland. I hope you enjoyed seeing the Christmas trees inside of Disneyland. And on our adventures, I actually received a bit of advice from the trees. Stand tall and proud, remember your roots, go out on a limb, and drink plenty of water. I hope you enjoyed our video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.